let's start from uh, the hardware. So the NGCAM system of module that uh, will be used for uh, this example is uh, the iCore MX8 and Mini that is equipped with an NXP uh, processor. Its cores are a quad ARM Cortex A53 and um, also for real time graphical application, a Cortex M4 support any kind of uh, peripheral and um, it can run both with Linux and Android. What I would like to stress about NGCAM module is the fact that they are actually part of uh, the EDIM standard. Uh, many of you maybe know the, the SODIM standard that is a, a, a mechanical standard. That means that you can plug and unplug your system of module from a board. But uh, NGCAM create this internal standard for this product that make a further step of compatibility because uh, all the modules that follow the EDIM has also specific configuration in the system of module pins output. This means that if you have two different modules that are both EDIM modules, you can plug them in the same board without any change from a software point of view. And there are several uh, advantages for this approach because, um, as I just said, there is compatibility with the, with the modules, but uh, there is also scalability. So if you are uh, creating a system for a specific application with an EDIM system or module and you realize that you have not, not enough computational power, you can just unplug the module they are using, plug another module with a different processor and uh, a higher computational power and then um, keep on developing your system. So there is compatibility and also complete scalability. Then uh, other important feature of uh, the NGCAM uh, product with the NXP um, modules are uh, uh, the longevity program that grant uh, long-term production availability and the robustness of the NGCAM system module as we perform tests also under thermal and mechanical stress. Now let's keep on describing the hardware that uh, we are going to use uh, in this presentation. Uh, I told you about the system module, now uh, I will introduce you the board that we will use with the uh, with the MX8 and Mini, that is the EDIM Starter Kit 2.0. You can, of course, check on, on the website uh, also the other board and all the peripherals available. And this is a picture of the Starter Kit. So basically it's EDIM compatible, of course, and uh, once you plug any EDIM module uh, here you can have actually support for all this peripheral, but you're gonna see it later in the video.